morning, good morning, good night, and good afternoon, wherever you are in the world. We're on the job site again. And it's my mum's birthday. Happy birthday, mum. My poor mum's in hospital. Concrete's here. My poor mum's in hospital. She had a heart attack on um, Saturday night, luckily. You didn't answer the phone. Yeah, okay. Yep. I saved the life. I got there in time. Ambulance got there in time. It was good. She was lucky, barely. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Concrete Ninja. It's like 6.30 in the morning here in Australia. It's Friday and it's my mum's birthday, like I said. She's uh, 78 years old today. And she had a heart attack on Saturday night. I was about to go out, 11.30 at night, and I got a phone call from my mum. She said that she's dying, she couldn't breathe. I had to race home, got an ambulance, and we just got her in time. So she's been in the hospital the last four days. Poor lady, but um, she'll be right. Hopefully she'll be good. She'll make it to her birthday anyway. So happy birthday, mum. I'll see you later on this afternoon. We'll go and see you. Right, the job's concrete here, and the job's ready. It's a house lab with Dave and Harold and and Golf Digger Phil and Nike. So um, yeah, we'll go and get into it. Enjoy your day. Share this video if you can. Leave a comment. All right, we're back into it again. Oh, it's Friday, Harold. You happy? I'm happy, mate. Oh, I'm gonna work tomorrow. You don't have to. No way. No. <laughs> I do. You're gonna help me surf your mates. But um, anyway. This is what we're doing, look at that bloody big beams again. Who's engineering these things? Beams everywhere, but anyway, we'll get into it. Let's go. Well, we're going around the footings now. This um, slab, because it's so high off the ground up here, it's got gear holes all in it. I'm trying to show you some up here somewhere. We're going around the, we're going around the outside. But there's like some holes like this. Holes down there. All through it. You gotta drill your holes into your natural ground. You know, the house is sitting on natural ground. So they're everywhere. Right. See how it's risen off the ground here? That's that's why you gotta do it. Lock it into the natural. Alright, let's go. Alright, we've got a brand new Master Finish Trail. 109A. That's the size I like to use the most. Let's um, make a video with it today, hey? And we might get Master Finish to give some away. Would be good. Ah, in the mornings I like to stretch all the time. I like to touch my toes. Ah, stretch my shoulders. Just get yourself stretched a little bit. It's been pretty tight in the morning, especially if you worked the day before. Leaning on my shoulders. Get some blood pumping into them. Ah. Yeah, warm up. Ah. Yeah, that's it. All the boys are laughing at me. Warm up. But I always warm up. Like I said, every morning you should stretch, warm up before you start work. You want to warm your back up. I always keep my jumpers on, keep my back warm. You don't want your back to get cold and snap on you. <laughs> so you always got to be careful. Warm your shoulders up, warm your like, legs up, warm your kneecaps up. Warm everything up you can, especially if you're in the cold, in the cold weather. Oh, it can really snap you. You've got to be really careful. And make sure you keep your water up as well because you never know. You're being dehydrated, that can actually make your body sore as well. I'm always dehydrated, that's why I'm always fucking sore. <laughs> I gotta drink a lot more water. Leave a comment in there. Ninja, drink some water. And I'll make sure I drink some water. I hope that helped you guys a little bit of tips. That's what I do when I warm up in the mornings. Get ready for the day. Let's go. I'm about to scrape some concrete. Well, it's 20 to 8. And then we've got some in now. We've got another three trucks coming, so hopefully that will put most of it in. So far, it looks pretty good. Just screw it a little bit then. Screw this bay here, that bay there, and that one up to about there. And Dave did the rest in there, in the pipes. It's good. Some more pier holes. 
pages over there and pull in. <laughs> oh, look at that beauty. Beauty and the beast. The beautiful concrete and the fucking feel, the beast. Bull fighting it. <laughs> <laughs> That sounds bad, isn't it? In your face. I think we're going to do this bit this way. Nice and low, the bullfight. Nice and flat. If you hit a hump, you'll see it. Yeah, I'm not Unless it's wet, wet. <laughs> and then you'll push it. That's it. Thanks, Phil. It's 8.30. And we got, we're a bit over half. We're just waiting for concrete all the time, so nothing we can do about that, really. I'm just gonna have to um, wait for the concrete. Let's go. It's 8.36 and we finally got some more concrete. Thanks, Hanson. But um, we've got a lot more beams up, so I'm not going anywhere yet.
How was that bit? Five minutes. Beautiful. With a shit labourer. This kid. He's not a very good labourer yet. He's still learning. I hope he's enjoyed. Not sure what time it is, but we nearly got the whole slab in. We're just going to wait for one more truck. God damn it. I think we're going to back the truck up. We're going to fill the beams on the back and we're just going to back the truck up. So um, I'll go and screed this little bay over here and get it happen. We're just sitting around waiting for concrete. Still hasn't come yet, but um, don't forget I'm on Facebook now. All these videos are going to be on Facebook as well. So if you want to go over to Facebook and there's a lot more prizes over there and I'm maybe going to do a subscription thing. So if you guys want to ask personal questions, maybe make personal videos, you can subscribe to my Facebook. It's going to be about five dollars a month and you can ask me any question you want and i'll answer it for you and um yeah we'll make it a bit more private for you over there so i'll set it up soon i'll let you all know when you can come over there and um subscribe to my facebook page there's already 80 83 000 followers over there but um yeah it's a different setup so we'll see how we go but i'll let you i'll keep you um i'll keep you informed about what's going on so because a lot of people ask me questions all the time and I don't answer all your questions. I've got too many questions all the time. So if you really want me to answer your questions, you go over to here and subscribe and um, yeah, I'll definitely answer your questions. All right, get back in there. Okay, it's 10 o'clock and we finally got it all in. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Dos. Looks good, looks really good. All right, let's finish her off. Harold's put his bolts in all the way around as well. Bit of a cyclone hazard out of here. The wasted pods that we have. Hmm. Someone's gonna pick them up before they go everywhere. <laughs> Alright, guys, I've got the master finished trail out. We've done a bit of magging. We might just see if we can do a bit of trailing now. Brand new trail, always a bit of a Prick, but if it's nice and flat, it should be easy. Look at that. Everyone doing it with one hand today again. Beautiful. First trowel is always the important one. Nice and flat. You find that you got rocks flicking up, that's why you're lifting the trail up too early. You're flicking the stones. You don't want to flick the stones. And your fur is your best friend. You know what I mean? You just keep it flat, everything's flat. The whole time. It's easier to run over flat concrete than bumpy concrete. Don't you reckon? Guys. If you want to um, win one of these trails, share this video. If it gets up to 100, 100 shares, we'll give away two trails. Leave a comment down below that you shared, and um, we'll see what we can do for you. I'm going to announce the winner of the screeds. I'm going to give two screeds away on that one of the other videos. There's a few guys. Oh, here's that pointy bit. That's what you need the pointy bit for. Beautiful. You get it all at the right time, it's easy. You take, you fucking fuck around. You go to the shop or something. Come back and it's too dry. That's why you're having a hard time. It's all about time and concreting. You know. Look, oh, nice and flat. Because we flat trail so flat, gotta put a little bit of flex in it. So these videos are helping you guys. You young guys are learning. I know you old guys know what you're doing. You all tell me all the time. <laughs> tell me how to do my job. You gotta think, mate. We're all over in different countries, different concrete, different sand, different rocks. If it was all the same, it would be easy for everyone. It's not all the same, ever. 
Mm -hmm. It's that little bit there. So if you guys share this video and um, you can win yourself a master finish trout, leave a comment down below. I want 100 shares. We'll get 100 shares. I'll give one away. I'll give two away. All right. It is 12 o'clock. And we're, the slab's going really good. That top part's nearly done. All this area's nearly done. Once the arrow hits it one more time. And will probably hit it again. And then this just part down here. The plus load. Go a bit go. The boys are loading the timbers up. They're stripping it. I'm just doing the edges. Working really nice. New master trail, master finish trail, looking really good. Love a new trail. All right, let's go. Uh, Nike, you know, his birthday is 21st the other day. Look, he's got a tattoo. Show us Nike. Oh, nice rose. Oh, <laughs> happy birthday, mate. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're nearly done. We're nearly done. Well, it's 12:37. And the top part's done. Just this part here, we gotta do that. Looking, looking really good, mate. And the boys are stripping their heads off over here, so I thought I'd show you I'm in action. Scraping, picking them up, ripping them off. No mussing around here. <laughs> Beautiful, Dave. Look at that little, little print there. <laughs> little shadow. Good thing to get rid of all your pegs and then fry all your timbers off. Then clean your timbers and put them away. These boys are going really good today. They've actually beat us again, haven't you, Phil? You beat us again, finishing. See, that's how it should be. If you don't fish, stripping before the finishers finish the concrete, you're not a good fucking, you're not a good labourer, mate. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing something wrong. You're fucking around too much. Because this is how it should be. Always strip before they're finished. Hey, Harold. Got him, mate. Got to be done, Otherwise eh? Otherwise you're sacked and replaced. That's right. <laughs> That's why we never got sacked, hey, Harold? <laughs> We're still here fucking 30 years later. What did we do wrong? We should have fucking took our time. <laughs> We're idiots. We're idiots. Yeah. Just the wrong ones. <laughs> ones, that, <laughs> ones that keep our clothes on. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Not Phil, but he's a rich fucking stripper. Look at him. He's a gold digger. Oh, I know you got him in the face. All right, I'll see you at the end. All right, guys, it's 10 to 1 and we are done. The slab is finished. It's all stripped around the outside. Boys have put everything away. Me and Errol are finished. And stick around that last little plus bit, and that's it. The rest of it's done. It's got a little bit of fur on it, so the tiles can grip to it. That's what we want. We want the tiles to grip to the concrete. You can't polish it too much, you're blacking it. You can actually make the tiles not stick. I know some guys I work with, they like to blacken them, but what I know is that you shouldn't really do that. If you've got tiles on top, you want to leave it a little bit furry. That's why Lawrence always sticks trails out at the end, a little bit of fur on it. Something to grip onto. But anyway, that's it. Day's done. All right, guys, hope you've enjoyed that video. There's a little bit of screening, a bit of troweling, a bit of choppering, a bit of stick troweling, a bit of, um, a bit of stripping, a bit of everything. So, hope you've enjoyed, hope you've appreciate us making the videos for you. And um, don't forget to go and follow me on Facebook. And if you're on Facebook now, go and follow me on Instagram and on, um, on YouTube. If you want, but anyway, you don't have to, whatever. I don't give a shit, really. <laughs> but, um, yeah, hope you've enjoyed. And if you can, share this video, leave a comment, and tell us what you would like to see next. Give us a shit if you want. I don't care. Whatever. All right, I'll see you all next time. Thanks, boys. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. They don't like saying bye. They don't like saying bye, these guys. I don't know their problem. See you, Dave. See you later, brother. <laughs> see you, bye, Aaron. Bye, mate. Thank you. I'll make them say goodbye. Bye, See you, mate. Dimitri. <laughs> See you, Phil. Good work, buddy. <laughs> Everyone was awesome. Good day. Friday. Let's Bye go. World. Bye, world. <laughs> Bye, YouTube. Bye, Facebook. Bye-bye. All right. That's my day over.
Thank you, Friday. Does anyone even like Barbies anymore? Am I even relevant? Oh, of course I am. I'm Barbie. <laughs>